What's up guys, it's your best games and today we have more links from the TES Discord server uh, including the entity system and uh, some rap map remakes and many more so let's check them out but before I start and you do me a huge favor hit that subscribe button like and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of my upcoming content coming in the future as more uh, uh, leaks from uh, showcasing leaks from the discord server multi yes series and many more that can be on my channel let's get started so new entity system also handles units so as you see the fallen and the railgun tank moves super smoothly but wait i see a tower battles reference this is how the entity system works in Bad Tower Battles 2. TES, you got some explaining to do again. Okay. The Grass Isles ra map remake. So, another remake from the Grass Isles. And... Path looks the same. Like in the current one. As you see right now. On screen. So entrance is basically here, exit there. Maybe. So here are some uh, angles from the grass iso remake. Yeah, but one thing to note that changed. I mean, the map looks a uh, different, but. Yeah, this wasn't in the current or grass also. Uh, but it's like an addition, but it's overall it's still different. And again, the entity system is almost complete. Our team of testers will hopefully be doing tests uh, starting this weekend. If tests go great and any issues we find get resolved, then we could definitely see the system launching at later this month. So. The Tower Battles reference entity system will get released. Let's watch this video. Yeah, as you see, there is a lot of uh, mecha mechas, or I can call them marks, because that's what they called, I think. Uh, they are super stacked in together, and they move very smoothly at 60 FPS, which is amazing, that I have never saw in any TDS game, I guess. Mm, yeah, this... I don't know how is that supposed to work, but uh, I haven't saw a lot of enemies just coming like stacked together and just running through to your base. I don't, I don't know why did they do that. Uh, they could just keep it, but I guess maybe military base glitch was, was patched. But I saw a video which is still in there so maybe that's the cause okay we got next leak which is the arrows and they are moving oh, it's not loaded uh, and they move to the exit and from the entrance uh, but as you see here they are very different from other TES games so they are three hours at once in one model and they are just basically different from other TES games that's broken okay so now the hardcore map remake which is the wrecked battlefield so as you know the current one yeah void weaver swinging just at that bridge 
<gasps> but now there is no bridge, so Boy River won't be swinging like a monkey anymore, and he'll just go normally through the map. To the exit. So we have a portal, uh, a new portal, which the enemies will come from. Nice, and uh, you may guess, or may, or you may. I just feel bad about it because there's not a lot of ground space. Well, good news. There will be a ground uh, place over here too. On these uh, uh, lower cliffs. So that's good. Uh, cliff spots will be up here on the upper cliffs. And we also got uh, the plane back here. We got that far crashes and many more here's some angles too and we also got a portal animation amazing let's take a look Yeah, first portal that is animated in TDS. Or correct me, correct me if I'm wrong. Okay. So now we got military power. So military soldier and military sniper. Wait, another tower battles reference. And we got two uh, military skins. New skin crate, leak, real. Oh, uh, that's not the only two skins. Maybe there'll be probably more. This is only a leak, so there will be more. So my guess is there will be a military skin crate uh, incoming, and there also is a nice side note. There is a balance testing, and they aim to rebalance most of the towers. So, they can rebalance the militant, I guess. Or maybe uh, some of the explosion towers. Even the freezer. So, I hope they rebalance these uh, bad towers. Because they are really bad. So what do you guys think about these leaks? Let me know in the comments and so f all of the leaks we got is entity system, two new uh, map leaks, I mean the finished entity system, and a poor animation and a new skin crate upcoming. So I hope you enjoyed, peace.